Butaleja district is ranked among those with a high fertility rate in the country, where every woman is estimated to produce between eight to nine children in her lifetime. Experts say that most girls get pregnant really early, and each year the number of newborns in the district increases. For example, in 2019, there were 2,601 deliveries, while in 2020, the number shot up to 2,664, and most babies were born to women below 18 years. Joyce Mugaba is among those who gave birth recently at just 16 years of age. She claims that losing her father at only two years destroyed her hopes of a bright future and at 16 years, a man promised to educate her but on the condition of having intercourse with him. She nearly died while giving birth, and her first months of taking care of the baby almost led to a serious mistake due to lack of experience, lack of awareness, and of course, poverty. <laughs> Mugaba is lucky because she got a chance to go back to school. Mugaba is only a drop in the ocean of such teenager mothers, and this has persuaded the district leaders to accept that something needs to be done. A district dialogue was organized by Uganda Youth and Adolescent Health Forum to address such issues in order to have a better district. In the dialogue, it was revealed that other factors remaining constant. Parents are a key factor towards teenage pregnancies. Most of our parents are poor. They are not able to take children to, to school. So they look at the girls as sources of income. And when a girl grows up to around 12, 13 years, they marry them off. Dr. Chisto also narrated the health risks they are dealing with as the teenagers give birth. Others can even bleed. They can bleed to the extent of blood transfusion or even death, bleeding, severe anemia. Other stakeholders believe that there is need for intensified sensitization among the youngsters. We've convened uh, Young Mothers Forums on, on, on Safe Motherhood, where we teach girls basic concepts of safe motherhood like breastfeeding, uh, immunization, uh, the importance of delivering from health facilities, uh, family planning. We've, 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 uh, we've done some uh, uh, you know, community activities to promote family planning services for young people. It should be noted that by 2018, Butaleja District had the youngest grandmother in the country by the names of Sumaya Najumba at only 28 years, which clearly indicated the intensity of the problem.